Uh, just uh, briefly, a, a follow-up. Uh, is the president, <coughs> is he receptive of what the Israelis are doing to push humanitarian aid, or is he happy with what they're doing now? I, I mean, there's no, I don't have a different answer for you to what I was asked by Karen. We are having those discussions. We've seen some improvement over the last 30 days. We want to see more because there are dire, there is a dire situation happening in Gaza. Also, the U.S. has been uh, leading in getting humanitarian aid. And so those discussions continue. We want to see more, and we're going to continue to have those discussions. And just briefly on Haiti, uh, with the situation there, do you have any statement or reaction to what's going on there with, with the violence and those being, being targeted at this point? Yeah, so um, look, we're certainly, uh, as it relates to the commercial flight, um, very recently, um, the gun, the gun uh, shots uh, that were reported. So we're certainly concerned uh, about the increase of violence in Haiti. Um, and uh, as it relates to commercial flights uh, in, and what occurred there, uh, the airport, Toussaint Lavatour Airport, uh, is operations are temporarily closed until November 18th. And so certainly uh, the airlines could speak more to that. Uh, but we are definitely uh, certainly concerned by the increase of violence and uh, we'll continue to work uh, with, as you know, there's a, a, a new prime minister that was named uh, and recognized by the, um, the TPC, the Trans Transitional Presidential Council. And so, um, uh, so we're going to uh, continue to, to, to work uh, with them and, and uh, hopefully uh, we can get to a better place.